Kumi here, back with another video, and today we're gonna talk about Zenless Zone Zero. Uh, the live stream just finished, the the launch live stream, because the game releases like next week or like three days, uh, depending on when I post this video. And um, yeah, we just watched it together uh, on Discord with my uh, community. So if you guys wanna join us for watch parties sometime, uh, most of the time I watch on Twitch, but this time I couldn't. Um, and yeah, the livestream just ended, they revealed a lot of stuff, a lot of new characters, uh, a lot of rewards, uh, a lot of story about the game, etc. They explained like the open world, the story behind all the characters, the, the main story as well. So it was pretty exciting actually. I wasn't necessarily like super hyped by ZZT, uh, but after this livestream I'm a little bit more excited, so we'll see. Uh, the gameplay looks fun. Uh, I think the game is going to be super nice, super fun, so I'm excited. Also, I want to make sure to mention that this video is actually sponsored by Hoyoverse, so thank you so much Hoyoverse for sponsoring this video. Uh, I'm already doing like, I mean, all my content is Hoyoverse games already, uh, on this channel at least. Um, but I really appreciate them for uh, reaching out for sponsoring this video. Um, and I'm probably going to make a few extra videos in the next few weeks, so stay tuned. And uh, yeah, let's talk about the, the live stream. So yeah, they started the live stream with like a cool music video, uh, some animations. Uh, the music is not bad, honestly, pretty cool. I, I kind of enjoyed it. Uh, and then they started talking about like the story a little bit, uh, like what's happening with those uh, holos. I think they, I don't know if the holos are like the monsters or just like the, the, the bulls, but uh, yeah, basically uh, there's some monsters uh, arriving and taking control and like invading the the area, and we have to uh, we have to fix this with the help of our little Bongu Bong Bongbu Bongbu. I think I forgot the name, <laughs> but uh, yeah, basically that's pretty much it. And we have a lot of characters that will be available to do that and to do like some cool uh, fights, cool combos and stuff like that. Uh, they look pretty nice, honestly. Like. Uh, the graphics are pretty clean, the animations are kind of nice, uh, it's, I think it's going to be fun. Uh, I don't think the game is going to require, I mean, I don't know yet, alright? I haven't had, I haven't tested close beta either, by the way, uh, but it seems fun. We'll see if it takes, if it doesn't take too much time, it's just like some sort of small arcade game uh, where you get the characters you want and then you just have fun and maybe it's not going to be too difficult either, so... Uh, I think we'll have a good time. I'll definitely test it next uh, week or like on the 4th of July when it releases. Uh, when it releases and uh, I'm excited. So yeah, they showed like a lot of new characters by the way. So the, the characters are like divided in factions in like sort of like teams or families or whatever. Depending on which areas they're coming from. And uh, they look pretty cool. They look pretty cool. Uh, I think these look cool. These look super cool. They're kind of like samurai. I'm all... I'm all I'm always a fan of Samurais, like everything related to like, uh, yeah, to like Samurais and stuff. Uh, it's kind of my jam, so they look really cool. I'm really excited. These guys look cool. I think it's like the police of uh, the police of like the, the area or something, like the city. Um, the character design is not too bad. It's not too bad. It looks, I mean, it's not like simpler than HSR or Genshin. I don't know how to explain it, but it looks a little bit more like, yeah, more like arcade kind of. But they look cool. They look cool. And so, yeah, they're like divided in factions or something like that. These are like the cunning Aris. I do not know what that means. <laughs> but yeah, those are like the main ones they showed uh, in like close beta and stuff like that. They look pretty cool. Same for these guys. Bellowbug Heavy. Pretty cool. They're like building stuff and... Uh, they're like building stuff in like buildings and homes and stuff like that. These are like housekeeping, Victoria housekeeping uh, company. Uh, so I guess it's like housekeeper company, pretty cool. Uh, and then there's the poly, the, I call them the police, but like, I don't know, like the, the criminal investigation special research. Pretty cool. Uh, these, okay, so I'm not really sure. All those special operations section six. Um, they, they kind of look like monsters as well, so I don't know if like they they fusion with like spirits or stuff like that, but they look cool though. They look cool. Pretty excited for those actually. What the guy on the right is, if it's actually gonna be playable or not. Uh, these two look nice, and uh, I think we're getting wait we're getting one of those characters like on release. Uh, we got uh, Obol Squad. They, I, they showed her animations, I think, uh, on YouTube. We might check it after, actually, but look pretty cool. And then, okay, these are like idols. Okay. They look cute. 
Uh, and I think they're showing like, wait, are they not showing like one of the new characters? Uh, yeah, maybe not. Like very, very cool animations. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. It's pretty exciting. Looks, looks fun. Yeah, I think I think it's gonna be fun. It's pretty dynamic as well. Oh, so I'm I'm quite excited actually. Animations are pretty good. Yeah, here's the fighting, uh, the combat system and stuff. Pretty nice. You can do some like like intro kind of uh, skills where you swap and you deal damage when you like charge a bar or something like that. That's that's pretty cool. When you dodge. Um, that looks pretty good. That looks pretty good. They show like two new characters as well. Hey, it's like <laughs> been to win. Uh, she's like Garen or something like that. What the hell? <laughs> uh, hey, she looks fun. Her, she looks super fun. By the way, she she throws like something and then explodes. Wait, she has like some small guys that like attack enemies. Look at that. <laughs> Look at them. They're bullying the monsters. Okay. And then her ult is like a big explosion. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. And her, she's like police girl or something. Like using guns. And it looks... It's pretty... It's pretty dynamic. Big. Oh, and I think we're getting her on release, by the way. I think that's her that we're getting... Uh, on, on the release. I think it's gonna be the first character. I'm not sure. I think that's it. I think that's her. Uh, from what I understood. Helen Joe. Yeah, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, available on the 4th of July. So it's she's gonna be she's gonna be here on release. It's gonna be the first banner character. The first character to four. So uh, she looks fun as well. And then second banner is gonna be Ju Yuan. I, I hope I pronounced it well. Um. Juyuan, so she, they both look good, honestly. They both look good. I'm a little bit more excited for Juyuan, actually. Uh, they both look good. And then... Uh, wait, I think they showed a code at some point, but... I'm not sure. The Bongbus look cute. Look pretty cute. I think... Oh yeah, they made like... <laughs> they made a coffee ad. What the fuck is this? Look at that. It's pretty smooth, though. It is pretty satisfying to watch. Look at that. Oh wait. Oh my god. Oh, yeah, it's pretty it's pretty satisfying to watch. They they, they put all their work on this one. <laughs> they put all their work on this one. Oh my god. Puff cafe. Yeah, that was pretty cool. Well done. Uh I think they put like a, a code later on, but I mean the code is not usable yet anyway, so you'll be able to reuse it on release. They're probably gonna put reminders and stuff. Uh they showed the open world, it looks pretty cool. I kinda like the vibe. I kinda like the vibe. Um, yeah, I mean it's it's like a little bit simpler than like other games that we have, I would say, the HSR Genshin, but it's more like arcade. Um Alright, but it's it looks pretty nice. It looks pretty nice. Uh, and I think you can meet the characters in the open world as well. You can help the Bongbus everywhere, the battle pass. The battle pass. No. Those are the daily commissions. This is the battle pass, it looks like it. So, it looks really, really arcade like minigame. Everything. Um, there's still the TV stuff, but I think they, they made it way shorter than, than before. It's not going to take you too much time. And then, uh... Whoa, 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 that way, no, close, slow down. Play the game to obtain up to 80 free pools and 80 boupons. I think the boupons is like, I'm not sure exactly what it is. I think you can, like, you pull all the stuff. Maybe it's like for weapon or or for like the, the bongboos. I'm not sure. But yeah, we'll get a lot of pools on release, but I don't think it's going to be 100, like, um, like 80 as soon as the game drops. It's probably going to be like, with the content that is available, complete the relevant events to obtain rewards such as A rank agents and A rank W and giants. So yeah, it's probably gonna be like we're not gonna get 80 pulls as soon as we open the game, but we can still pretty much guarantee a character on release 
uh, maybe even two. I don't think they explained the pity, but it's probably gonna be similar to to Genshin and Eight Star. Uh, and then here they say a hundred pulls. So maybe they give us an, an extra 20 or something on the mail when the game release. Um, but yeah, I think that's pretty much it. Oh, oh, the code was here. Yeah, ZZZ free 100. Uh, you can use it starting July 4th. So you still have uh, to wait a little bit. Uh, I mean, you have to wait until the release of the game. 300 primos, 30,000 money, and then a few XP stuff. So pretty chill, pretty nice. And then at the end, they did like a cute animation as well, I think uh yeah right here watch that and i think that was pretty that was a short live stream honestly for launch i'm not gonna lie that was a little bit short i expected like an hour live stream but i think that goes to show that the game is going to be a little bit simpler than the other ones probably uh a little bit faster paced maybe uh you don't have to worry too much about everything um but we'll see we'll see i'm excited still i'll definitely try it on the 4th of july and uh i'll be making some content around it uh we'll test the, the new characters uh we'll see what it is uh and we'll have fun so i'm excited hope you're excited too and uh and yeah that's pretty cool if you enjoyed the video please give a like uh drop a comment if you have anything to say about zzz uh if you're excited if you think the game is gonna flop maybe who knows if there's a character that you like uh and don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you on the next video Bye bye